This video is brought to you by the 3 Minute Board Game Patrons. Keep us independent by supporting us on Patreon. Kia ora koutou and welcome to Autobahn in about 3 minutes, review copy used. It has a solo mode, it's a game for 1-4 to four players, playing time is long and it's a pretty complex game. Over a period of 70 years you will be heading up construction of Germany's mighty Autobahn system. Can you build the best roads, deliver goods and ultimately promote your people into positions of authority to win? The game lasts for 3 errors and each error ends after the last road marker in its box is placed. The winner is the player with the most points and you score those based on where your workers are on this board. Action Selection each turn you will play a card to take an action. Deck building. You start with a basic hand of cards and will add more throughout the game. Pick up and deliver. You will load up trucks with goods to deliver. Play a turn. A key concept in this game is that each autobahn has a colour, and cards also have a colour. And to take an action that affects something on that colour autobahn, you need the matching card. You start with this hand of 6 cards, and may take one action per turn shown at the top of your board. Let's run through them. The key action lets you move the matching key from the left to the middle of the board. These are technologies, and they have two effects. First, each grants a bonus of some kind to the upgrading roads, deliveries, and service station actions. They also denote which rooms in the scoring board your workers can be in. The build road action is next, and it costs 8 because this is error 3 and it's the second part of a two part road. Claim the bonus token on the road. These tokens are one off bonuses you can use later, in this case this one would let us build another road. The upgrade action is next, and it costs 16 because if you're upgrading a double section you must do both. Upgraded roads and connections increase the worth of each city on that route. In both build and upgrade actions, you take one of your workers and place them on the far right of the matching coloured office. If that shunts a worker off the desk, they go to the lobby. The next action is to load a truck, and each production centre has a card and a good. You can then move your trucks along the roads. Note, whenever you play a card to any action and you have a truck on a road matching that colour, it moves. If a truck moves off the board, it delivers its carried goods. This may give you a one-off power you can trigger at the start of your next turn. You can also place service stations, which give you strong bonuses when your own trucks pass them, and weaker bonuses when other players' trucks do. And once per error, you can place a worker here just to gain funding. This symbol advances you on this track, which gives you upgrades including new cards, technologies and promotions. Promotions are how you advance in the scoring rooms from the lobby. The scoring rooms score based on workers in the office, deliveries made, service stations and money. You may take an action to reclaim your cards, gaining one coin for each, or if you have played them all, reclaim them for free. At the end of each area, you will get money and promotions based on the value of the roads and your contributions to building them. And at the start of era 3, add in East Germany. Rammstein. Why would you like this game? Autobahn has a lot happening in it and contains a myriad of different mechanisms. Network building, area majority scoring, card management, deck building, pick up and deliver, and possibly someone missing. Now that is either going to sound like catnip or a complete horror show to you. If you do like games with lots of interacting systems and figuring out those interactions is fun, this could be a good fit for you. There's also some good interaction here for a heavy Euro. As trucks block movement, other players work on roads you want to build, and there's limited delivery spots. But all up, very much a heavy Euro for heavy Euro fans. The well, best thing about this game is loading the trucks up. Some find it fiddly, I find it adorable. However, the amount of iconography in the game is a lot to take in especially as quite similar looking symbols can do things quite differently. I really would have liked the player aid for each player. And overall there's just a lot happening and a lot to keep track of, especially with delivery actions, bonus actions, and actions from upgraded cards all happening in one turn. For a different take on road building, try Maglev Metro. And for something faster and less complex, try Brass Birmingham. Autobahn. Your Fafa Nugan may vary. And if you enjoyed this video, hit the notification button, like, share, and subscribe to the channel.